I, um, well, I kind of burnt myself in the kitchen. I got a little too close to the pan and the oil hit me. So I've got some nice first, first and degree second degree burns. burns. You can see some blistering and some drainage. So I thought I'd take this opportunity to show you how I am caring for my burn at home. So I've washed it with some soap and water and I've got it patted dry. And um, the first thing I did, uh, I didn't have time to go to the pharmacy right away. So I actually had some, I always keep vitamin A and D in the house and I had a nonstick bandage. Um, I don't promote name brands, it, it rhymes with Schmelfa, but it's a nice nonstick bandage. And so what I had done was I put my A and D, it's so much easier to put it on the bandage and then put it on your wound rather than trying to get it right on your wound. So I just put it on the bandage and I smear it all around like that. And then I put that on over the burns. Oh, and it cools it right away. So that's what I had done the first night. And then by the next day, I had time to go to the pharmacy and everything. And I found these really cool burn pads and they're so soothing. And again, I'm not promoting a, a certain name brand. I just like the product, uh, a cooling moist pad. Um, I got these at a place called, Sh rhymes with small greens, um, but so cool. And so what they are is you just peel the little plastic back and it's got a nice cool hydrogel. So I've been putting those on my burns and again, so soothing. Oh, it puts the fire out right away. And then I just cover this with a gauze and um, it lasts me all day. I change it the next day. So um, uh, you can't say I don't suffer for my art. Thanks. This is two days later. I wanted to show you the progress. It's doing awesome. Lots of new skin. These white areas, that's not pus. This is normal wound drainage, sometimes called slough. It's doing great and I already feel so much better. I'm keeping a moist dressing on it. And here it is a week later. There is fresh skin over everything and over time the scars will lighten. I'm Wound Care Karen and this has been a Wound Healing Minute.